Hello everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian today, or tonight, <laughs> because we're not doing an afternoon stream. Uh, and welcome, uh, with, along with, makes I'm myself. First Mitra Kier at your service. And welcome back to the. This should be number six of uh, Commanders to Men of Courage. And I see we have a new follower in the alert. Yeah, we, I forgot how it's called. The, 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 yeah, the alert. What was? <laughs> Let me look this up. Uh, the event they, box. It's called. Uh, that, I guess they. Hmm? I guess they might join when try when watching the restream. Or something? It uh, could be, or they jumped over from a different stream that we raided through the shoutouts and such. Uh, but anyways, uh, last time we had some technical difficulties and we got through the uh, target Burma mission, which <laughs> ended rather anticlimactically, with the tyrant just running into gunfire. And currently we are b busy with Bridge Over the River Cry. After which we have the guns of Sappho Island. We should be able to finish this in this stream. And after that, the giant... Wait, the giant in Hainpong? I I don't remember a thing about this. We can actually take a look at the preview. Oh, this one. <laughs> this one is... This one has an interesting bit. But uh, yeah, that's just the intro. <clears throat> I do like that they have these previews. We uh, it gives you something to look forward to and a, just, well, a preview, a, a taste of what's to come and such. Yeah. Uh, Don't make him have that. Uh, wait. Okay, for a moment I thought, did we just reload to the start of the mission or something, but no. Uh, yeah, last time Finn's slaughtered the... <laughs> Been, uh, slaughtered half the people that were here, or well, practically all of them. There's only a few left in here, I, I believe. Uh, let's get that box. It's for looping to unlock. Mm -hmm. And this should be where the model of the bridge is stored. And we need the help of the prisoner that we freed to point out the weak spots in it so we can blow it up, even though, well, we already put the explosive in place. We still don't technically know. That is, that's the weak point there. Oh. Okay, not sure what happened there. I tried to tag this one. Instead, we just walk through the wall. <laughs> Something. On the case. Either case. Ah, oh, damn it. Here we go again. Yeah. You barely started, and you're already messing up. <laughs> yep. Wait. I think you're broken your record in messing up. Yep. Gameplay-wise. Oh, we got rid of the sniper at least. And there aren't have, actually chasing. Yeah, we have had starts with technical difficulties and such, but messing I'll up gameplay-wise this early? That's a rarity. Yeah, th th this game can be pretty... They didn't actually chase after me, okay. I'm going. You hallucinate, perhaps? Uh, no, he's no, he was just freaking out over the body. Yeah. Uh, was he headed? It looked like he was headed for the door, yeah. not the ladder there. Is he actually going to chase now? I'm going. Yep. Okay, well, I'm not sure why he wasn't spinning there. I'm going. Really? <laughs> you saw someone in diving gear and very much not uh, Japanese or Eastern looking pop out of a door and you do not give chase when they go through? That's Mr. Keeper Tourist. <laughs> uh, not sure what player kind of plays as. Well, slave labor bridge tourism. On the case. Let's let's hope never for none. Ah! Here we go. Easiest way I'm to deal going. with them. And, well, we weren't going to kill either of these two without the other one hearing anyways. I'm going. Okay. 
arm up a bit. Oh, also, I found out this fish food uh, it can be used by the diver, but only on the water to lure the well to lure the piranhas or the crocodiles. Yeah. Not, not sure if you can actually use it uh, to get them to attack the enemies or not. Yes. But oh well, we at least we now know that. It might want to stand up. Finished. Okay. Um, once we have him look at that thing, we should be about done with this mission, I think. I'm on my way. Well, gentlemen, this is what you have to do. But make sure you do it right. There is a convoy waiting to cross the bridge. You should hide the trap by placing it with a group of barrels here. All you then have to do is to send a straightforward telegraph message informing the train that the bridge is complete and that it can now cross. When the train then crosses the bridge, the vibrations will set off the trap. Okay, uh, that is, <laughs> that is uh, easier to work with than uh, needing to time a detonation and such, because, well, detonation cords can have a habit of not working. Yeah, and uh, it's kind of impressive they used the trace vibration to make it explode. Yeah. And since this guy is a, an allied colonel, he can only use a, a pistol I'm with going. infinite ammo. So let's just go grab, uh, go grab one for him. Or... Yeah, let's trade. <laughs> Wine for a pistol. Mm -hmm. You traded with a dead man. There, he should be able to just fire continuously. Though the, the gun actually, the gun doesn't do that much uh, damage since, well, the ones that we typically start with, not that we, not that Pins has it. Uh, they, they take about three shots to get a kill, I believe. On. Yeah. And. Oh dear. Actually, is there a window we can? Yes, there is a window we can chuck stuff through. So, Thread is going to be <laughs> Thread is going to have to come over here, and well, since he's the driver, he might as well drive a boat over. <laughs> yes, yes, I know it's sail, but he can at least pretend to be. Oh wait, you don't even have a freaking paddle, really. No one could have done it better. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. Let's go. There's a Except robot. for Finn, who literally could have done it better because he's the only one probably with a pat. Uh, yeah. I'm going. Oop. With a paddle to get that stupid thing moving. I'm going. Also, let me let's deal with these two before they become an actual problem. Yeah. And since that one's coming in close. Wait. wait. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hello. Why not throw smokes? Near the crocodiles. And yeah, as you can see there, it's you can just completely miss shots. And okay, Vince is almost dead. Okay, someone with hill with the med kits. Uh, yeah, Lupin, just run over, jab him in the ass, and send him on his way. Okay. Do we have? Oh yeah, we have wine. Yep. I feel like we should test it that to. Inspect where the crocodiles go, throw a bottle of wine or smoke, and see if the soldiers will be near and if the crocodiles will attack. Oh, but, but... what the... Oh, but... What? You killed where, Guinness? Where the fuck did they come from? <laughs> where the other fuck are they from? <laughs> uh, and now all of them are running for the smokes and the... Uh... Okay. Yeah, what... What the hell... What the other hell happened there? <laughs> I have a theory. <laughs> that might have been an unexpected patrol. I have no... If it was a patrol, we probably would have yeah. seen them uh, by now. Move around. Hmm. Yeah. I guess now we have a chance to try out the experiment, at least. Uh, yeah, oh, and moment. he just does not see the body at all, apparently. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, 
J. Uh, don't forget the cigarettes. Yep, probably best to pick those up before someone else comes for that. Uh, what if the, that's what happened? So someone is walking nearby, saw the cigarettes, then saw you. Actually, there is the there was one guy over here. Maybe he would. Maybe he got off on an, an audio alert or something. But don't run in there. Look in there. Okay, this is. No, we didn't see any workers in the horde. Also, what what is that? It doesn't look like a cannon. I never throw in the tower. Oh, oh, it's easy. Weren't they gone earlier? Okay. But, yeah, I, I guess they heard the gunfire and came rushing. Yeah, there came rushing over. Okay, then yeah, let's do this secret trick. Says that probably would be more silent than a gun. Hey, wait a minute. Did he actually come through this time? Yes, he did. <laughs> okay, so he finally figured out how to work a doorknob and promptly died. Oh dear. Okay, now we can take these two out. I'm going. And the one. And the two. I'm going. Not the body. Picking up the knives can be a little bit annoying, but it's easy enough. Okay, Guinness up and over. And this time we're putting down a save. And, well, we might as well just Come skip on. the little cutscene. Here we go. And one more disruption for a quick save. Yeah, this, this is annoying. Uh, no, a bit annoying. But it's a whole lot easier to work with than uh, <clears throat> just the stuff that we were having with uh, es <clears throat> Escape from Monkey Island. Or games that were old and needed some fiddling with. Yeah. Also, I don't think we have. Actually, we do have one soldier. You've got the right man. That uh, we can try the alligators oh. on. But first, let's take a look here. Okay. Okay, some more toys for threads. <laughs> I can fuse smoke grenades for cans of food. That would that would be a a very interesting mistake to make. <laughs> well, I can't see that happen if you only do like, as you did a quick launch. But good goes Which the situation God? where you accidentally threw a can of food at your enemy. Yeah, it, it could still knock them out if you hit them in the head, but still. Okay. Let's see if we can get him close yeah. enough to the crocs. Yeah. Let's see. We need to be in throwing range, of course. If you like. Hmm. Yeah, it would probably even work if the croc uh, that I was. Wait, that might be a, a, a new one coming up. Here we go. Oop. Croc had a bit of a sp speed boost. And apparently they yeah. don't give a crap about each other. That or they completely dodged... He completely dodged the croc sight. I think he... <laughs> Which is also possible. That's what happened. Oh, come on! <laughs> the crocs and the Japanese <laughs> are in... Are working together. Oh, I think it was a might have been a coincidence. He just looked away just at that time. But still, annoying for admit it would be cool if yeah. he can use that trick. Okay, did Again. that alert them this time? No, they're far enough away. Yeah. Oh dear. Oop. Okay, we got a bit lucky there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure if we'd gotten a bite out of Vince, that it would have been an instant kill. 
Okay, let's double check our objectives. Find a weak spot, summon the train by sending it on telegraph. And yeah. Okay, this one this one counts as a clue, not as a side objective. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Uh Thread, you come around. So Tiny is still just okay. posing there. Hmm. Yeah, the amount of crocs is a bit dangerous here, but yeah, we can just get in the boat. And there we go. The reason I'm bringing Thread over is because he could just he can just chuck a Molotov through the window and be done with it. Uh, let's see. These are also your work. Alrighty. Wait, we're in Thailand or Burma still? Uh, somewhere, yeah, somewhere in Burma, so close to India, I believe it is. And they aren't right, sitting too close to the right. window. But this might, this should still work. But let's do a quick save just in case. And yeah, like last time. Uh, uh -huh. Bur uh, Burma is current-day Myanmar. Okay, uh, Lord, uh, many, many calls the, the, the century have uh, been changed to the names quite often. Uh. And yeah, proof that it's, <laughs> it's three shots. I thought I caught both of them with the flames, but apparently not. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we don't have anything else, so uh, mission complete. <laughs> and yeah, this time no need for fake accents or anything, just beep, beep, beep. <laughs> the wheel is on a turning. Really? Now they are there we go. happy. Much happier. Especially now. <laughs> there we go. Though that only sent the locomotive into the river, but then again, <clears throat> in the surprise, they could prob the commandos probably could have ambushed uh, the brass and any guards that were with them. Okay, still no complete pictures. Still, though, they lost a very, probably a very expensive train and a bridge. Yeah. And another promotion to lieutenant. On the 28th of May, the Allies achieve an important victory at Midway, breaking the Japanese advance in the South Pacific, as well as equalizing their naval forces with the destruction of four Japanese aircraft carriers. But in July 1942, Allied naval intelligence sounds the alarm. The Japanese have constructed an airfield on the largest of the Solomon Islands, Guadalcanal, from where they could continue their offensive. The Allied High Command draws up a plan to take the island, codenamed Operation Watchtower, the largest amphibious assault since the beginning of the war. But there is an important obstacle in their way, the island of Sabu, located north of Guadalcanal. Strongly fortified, the island is bristling with heavy artillery, protected in underground tunnels, safe from the attack of bombers. In these conditions, any landing attempt at Guadalcanal would be a massacre. The island of Sabo is the key to Guadalcanal. You read a bit of script there? Stop! We're close enough. We've come to destroy the cannons, not the other way round. Let's examine the map. Okay, aerial defense, coast guard, lookouts, AA guns. I'll need explosives. There's a munitions hut where we'll surely find something to your liking. <laughs> need for a gun. I think they've seen us. There. Nah, I don't think he's an enemy. He looks more like a castaway. Yes, I agree. And he doesn't look good. We should go and see who he is. Okay, let's go. At your service. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Didn't mean to open the inventory. I, I constantly keep messing up the left and mouse and uh, left and right clicks. And uh, yeah, we've got sharks here. Mm -hmm. Very big sharks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, first thing that we're going to do is to have a little chat with uh, Fuzzy here. Hey, how big are these sharks? I've got him. What big mean? enough to kill. Big enough to kill. Aye, sir. Oh, I'm Sergeant Wilson of the Light Brigade, Lancers Division, serving under Her Majesty uh, uh, Queen uh, Victoria. Oh, I, d I don't remember my number. Did you bring tea? Oh no! Oh, it's inexcusable! I've been waiting for a cup of tea for 20 years! Well, the last one that fell from the sky had no tea either. Oh, now the demons have put him into soak. This island, you know, my island, it's full of demons, you know. They respect me, but they'll skin you alive if they catch you. Hide behind the vegetation, don't you know, and they'll not see you. Oh, and you'll soon hear the thunders. There are thunders every day, you know, and you'll hear the thunders in the tunnels too, so you can't sleep. I'll help you with my trumpet if you can silence the thunders forever, you know. Yeah, this dude's gonna a bit loopy uh, over 20 years. Possibly longer. Yeah. And he joins us. <laughs> Wilson. Uh, of course it's Wilson. But yeah. yeah. Alone on an island for that long time. Actually can mess people up. Well, actually, in some cases they just shut us down. Fine. Is it? There are seven of cases where people have died of Let's loneliness. Yeah. They, they just go plain insane. Now, I, he doesn't have a number, and this is the only place we'll have him, of course. Um, uh, here they are. He's not always by go. insane. They just straight up die sometimes due to the loneliness. Okay, and yeah, like he oh. said, they don't give a crap about yes. him. Oh, uh. oh dear. Right out. Okay, for a moment I thought I had some had people multi selected. Uh, uh, Let's see. What? There we go. Uh, yeah, they don't give a crap about Wilson, but he do. They do give a crap about him when he starts doing this. So yeah, he's a he's a big distraction. Holy! No. If I recall correctly, I, I don't remember too much about this mission. Oh, hello, little boat. A little? It's bigger oh, than yours. Bubbles. Okay, what's with those bubbles? Something swinging around there. And yeah, we've got a big old plane here. Something going up. Oh, someone is getting drilled. Like it, I, I, that is one thing that I do like about this game, just to... Uh, Random things that some of the soldiers seem to be doing. Yeah, he's kind of, uh, how to say, organic? Yeah. They aren't completely static and such. Okay. This looks like it could be a good spot to sneak in, since the gun isn't facing this way, but they do. we do have this guy here, and two in ambush. Okay, maybe not so much. So, yeah, this will be the best insertion point. This uh, is probably also the most used in insertion point. We just need to get Wilson up there and now distract what? the gunner. Or, well, just go around his limited sights. Uh, what about you? I'm just double checking if there aren't any uh, spotters uh, for uh, to. Yeah. Any spotters to work with them or something? Bloody, I hope I expect this shark to attack you raw. But I feel yeah. like they may have accidentally oversized the shark. Uh, but, uh, you weren't. 
we were not inside there. Okay. <laughs> On the 28th of May. Well, it still kinda makes sense he would, should be able to see you from there. Uh, true. Okay, let's do that again. Hmm. And this time we actually have Wilson distract the motherfucker instead of just hoping that the vision going is accurate. Hmm. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay. Get out. Give him a chat. Okay, that was a bit of a freeze frame moment for me there. Okay. Uh, Wilson, you go up there. Why is the boat selected? Let's go. What? There we go. Yep. Okay, you picky. Get over there first. Then Finns can follow you underwater. And yeah, we'll be dealing with a lot more underwater stuff in this level. Including, well, complete areas underwater that you need to transition between. That's a... okay. What can I show you? I, I know Greek bikes are huge, but. Let's see, does it say just shark? Yeah, of course, it says just shark. Okay, maybe maybe it's a great white, and I know I see them next to each other. There. Maybe they uh, just Jesus failed God. at the fin or something. Could be, but aren't yeah. white, great whites supposed to be well more white than that? It's more blue. At your service, huh? They're more bluish on top and white on the underbelly. Okay. <clears throat> We're ready. You, you thought they were albinos? Uh, no, I think I just had a more stereotypical <laughs> image of them in my mind. Okay. Uh, can but, uh, we can take... I... Can of that. Uh, let's, see. let's put down a save, just in case Vince is about to get nuked by a fucking artillery cannon. Okay. Oh dear. <clears throat> Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> it's... Okay, he does not have a blind spot there. If we had sent Pins along to follow uh, yeah, Wilson uh, yeah, at the surface, he would have been spotted and shot there. I'm going. Oh dear. And I probably should say... <laughs> well done. <laughs> Well, now we're going to see how effective that pistol is going to be with this. Reasonably, so far, can he take three? He actually can. Uh, um, take a look at his health. Uh, yeah, that cost him a lot, but he is still alive, and someone probably has some medicine on them. That saved us a lot of sneaking. Okay, you should be a rifleman. No, you're a patrolman. How do you look like a rifleman? Okay. Officer, we'll take those. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was, I was thinking to just sneak around, uh, just, yeah, just sneak around them, kill off these over here, then bring the rest over. But uh, yeah, we. <laughs> We got fast track through this part. Seriously, not a single rifle among you. Oh, this guy remains though. Oh, um, it's done. Um, actually, yeah, you, you're gonna need to distract I'm him going. somehow. Well, he doesn't give a shit about those. <laughs> I'm going. Or is it too far for him to see? Uh, it's in his line of sight. They aren't. Yeah. Always 100% accurate, but yeah, this is just a case of uh, them being too busy to actually care, like the uh, gunners in White Death. Also, oh, where's, right. so, yeah. where's the knife? Oh, there's the knife. Oh. Yeah, so, yes, people, we are still coughing. I suspect mm. we have one of those yeah. that 
that even when we are healthy, finally, the cough may still linger <laughs> for one or two more weeks. Or three, I've heard. Yeah, though there are extreme cases mm. like... If you like. Like, um, I, forgot what it's, I don't know what this called, some kind of flu. But I actually was uh, in do a dorm school sick for two if months. Ouch. And I, 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 I was sick more two weeks before it was... The cough lasted for two months. And it made Did doing any class almost impossible. Yeah. Says, Did he... I was mostly drawing and writing, and yeah. Doing that when coughing is not a good idea, and what just happened? I, I think he finally spotted the corpse right across him. Oh dear. Okay. I'm there we go, that's one gun disabled. Anything of interest? No. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. There we go, oh, just hide the body around the corner. It's gonna be good when this cough is gone. At least I finally shaved my cheeks today, my face cheeks. <laughs> the upper ones. For... Yeah. Ever since I got sick, I stopped uh, shaving part of my beard because, well, cough and shaving does not sound like a good mix. Yeah. Okay. And it was a struggle to shave uh, my upper face cheeks, my cheeks bone, I guess oh, you could say. <laughs> For yeah, it had gotten thick. Let's see. Okay, these two have line of sight in here. Uh, I'm guessing. <laughs> I'm guessing we shot their instructor, since uh, he's not around anymore. But they're still continuing with it. Okay, if we kill this guy while he's over here, yeah, his body moment. should remain hidden. Then we can just take this one out, and then this one. And actually, we could probably go for him right now. In a moment. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. I go. Here we go. Now retrieve the butter knife. I'm going. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. I'm having flashback for some... We a Swedish what? detective comedy show. No but someone killed a Russian mafia member with a butter knife right that he had hid in his boot. And after threw it, he said, uh, I forgot to get rid of the butter for the knife. Or something like that. Oh wait, it might be he still had some butter on it. In a moment. No, no not you, Fins. Okay. Yep. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, yeah, that was uh, to serenade his death then. <laughs> oh, dear gods. Okay, at least we have a rifle now. And yeah, as much as Wilson pisses them off with that trumpet noise, they don't actually go kill him. So, let's bring the rest in. Now that the coast is clear. And he's making surprisingly little noise as he's swimming like that at speed. He's quite fast with though. Considering the sharks, I guess he got a lot of swim lessons. Yeah, he has plenty of motivation to make speed. I'm not be surprised if he named every single shark. They like pain, agony, suffering, <laughs> annihilation, doom. I'm fully qualified. Okay. Mr. Thief. Yeah. Huh. All aboard. Uh -huh. uh, all off boards. There we go. We have basically the same team except we have Inferno instead of Lupin. So let's Thank thievery. You. Let's go. Uh, oh okay. God! I, I, actually, let's be honest. Ain't. Mr. Teeth, a bad shark name. Uh, it's it's too obvious. Okay, you have the medicine. Uh, no need to go show off your your swan dive. Okay, get back on land. Hand over your knife. 
Not sure why Inferno had a knife on him. Maybe he uh, lost his uh, uh, pincers for when you uh, deactivate the bomb, so use that knife instead. Uh, Kurtz, also, I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm giving Tiny his cigarettes back just in case we get a use for him. Now, Thread, you have your basic stuff. You have tripwire, man traps, and shovels to dig around with, smoke grenades, and <coughs> molotovs. Okay. Let's try and make a bit more use of the rest of the team at this time, instead of just focusing on Tiny or Finns, though they probably will be doing most of the work. Okay. Hmm. Let's see, we won't be able to lure him away since he's an officer and such. And I don't think the soldier looks this way at all. So where would be an opening for us to strike? You don't have any sight here. Actually, we could probably just... When he goes from this one to that one, just... One, two, three. And we have three knives now. Okay, then he... I thought he was breathing fire yeah, over there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. Hmm. It's easy as pie. Wait for him to be out of death screen range. And he's too close to the other one, so we'll just grab this guy and run for it. Okay. okay. I guess it's easy as pies as you do use a knife usually when you're dealing with the pies. <laughs> it's a bit bigger than a butter knife, though. Yeah. I'm going. Here we go. Nope. It could be worse. He could throw in um, spatulas. <laughs> that would be a thing, <laughs> like if like Spon like if SpongeBob SquarePants starts uh, Moonlight as an assassin. And Oscar woke up and is leaving the room. Yeah, he was asleep on the bed. Yeah, hopefully he did not hear you earlier before the stream calling him a. Background character. <laughs> you know, we yeah, everyone know a cat can be if you call them a background character. Yeah. Then we get revenge. Okay. Clear this place out. Now let's see what kind of goodies we have here. They seem to be a rather low on rifles this time. Actually, let's take the ammo just now. Okay. Nope. Oh. oh, yeah. <laughs> Inferno will like that. Anything else here we can look in? Actually, no. Hmm. Okay. Inferno, threads. Actually, first you two stand up. Wait. I need to double check here. Maybe I'll see this in another stream, but... When... When did they make the song Disco Inferno? Uh, somewhere in the 80s, I believe. I thought earlier, but I guess not during this era then. Let's go, sir. Maybe the 60s, I, I don't right, actually know specifically. Yeah, okay. if I wonder uh, if one could do a Disco Inferno joke with our Inferno here. <laughs> yeah, I think he's a, he has a bit too weight to be uh, too maneuverable on the dance floor, and I don't think you'd want him to be jumping around with high explosives like that. <laughs> um, I'm going! I think you're right. I'm going. Just the ammo. There we go. And then we can take this guy out. Ah, I'm going. <laughs> Just swan dive to the ground as we realize. Oh, we're almost going to get spotted. I'm going. Okay, yeah, I sort of looked around ahead a bit more. It's these two were just arguing yeah. with each other. What are our specific goals? Get I got an idea. 
I got a brilliant idea. We, we turn the cannon around towards the all green people, then fire. Oh, or wait, we could do something with it. Yep. It will probably alert the entire bloody island to us, but uh, uh, it would wait, solve wait, wait, the wait. argument. Wait, wait, save, then let me try it out. <laughs> okay, quick save. Inferno is probably going to get his ass kicked over this, but it'll be worth it. We're listening, sir. Okay. All of you to your feet. Let's keep going. And then we just line up over here. And since they all have a pistol, we can just uh, we we can't have them do we, <laughs> we can't have them go on Overwatch uh, together, knowingly enough. Okay. There. There. And thread as well. They can't hit each other. Well, that's so good. that is uh -huh. useful. Okay. Now we quick save again, so we don't have to do that ag ag well again. And yeah, we actually get a little scope as well with this. And here we go. <laughs> and there <laughs> Inferno goes. <laughs> uh, we probably could have dealt a lot more damage if we'd fired into this, this group here. But yeah, I think about half the island is coming now. I love this. Cool, the in would not allow you to do this. Uh. <laughs> Wait, they don't notice you. Yeah, they're they're inside and they don't have a reason to go inside at the moment. Oh, you 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 mean you ran away from the cannon damn quickly? Okay, okay. Uh, Inferno is uh, down here. You're oh, down. So they... Someone who just run in there looked, and they didn't notice you. Okay, I thought some, one of them walked uh, in, but no, they walked into the other... Uh, they walked into the other tunnel here, I think. Okay, let them freak out a little more. Hmm. Actually, this is a good moment to just pick off some more, I believe. Like, this one over here isn't supposed to be here at the moment. Mm -hmm. So wherever he was supposed to be, he is not going to be back there anymore. Yeah. I missed him. Oop. And they found a bond of body somewhere else. Actually... You go in here. Use a rifle of yours. Actually, actually no, I'm, I'm being dumb. I was thinking we could use grenades, but Inferno has the grenades, and he's kind of uh, hating life at the moment. He, he went down? Yeah, you can see him up here. He's yeah, next oh. to the cannon. Oh, so, oh he needs medkit, doesn't he? Yep. Oh! Hello there, Sensei Tadpole. You doing well? Better than better than Inferno, probably. I got pooped again. You, uh -huh. Sensei Tadpole, have you ever watched um, uh, if the Emperor had text to speech? Alrighty. Okay, that's good to hear. Doing mine. decently here as well. Still coughing, f annoyingly. Yeah, same here. I'm good, I feel healthy, but just... Yeah, the cough may just linger for a bit. Uh -huh. As in, uh, possibly a month. Boing. Okay, jab him up the ass again. But now that was Finn's last time. Okay. You did what? Uh, oh, you haven't? Well... Well, there's someone there that the boops on the snoot on a very explosive and very poisonous frog. Right now, yeah. Okay. 
Uh, but yeah, as you can see, we have uh, moved on to the next mission, or another mission. Uh, basically, we are not, we are currently in the Pacific Theater causing mayhem. And yeah, we are, we are here to take out these heavy er, cannons here to help support a landing in the Pacific Theater. And yeah, we kind of stirred up the hornet's nest by having Inferno take over this uh, this little cannon here and start shooting. Only he only got two kills before they overran and uh, well, quote unquote, killed him. Let's see. Shall we use them more? <laughs> yeah, we could. They they were bunched up quite a bit over here. And well, it is fun. It just depends yeah. on how many mid kits we have left. And we have three at the moment. Let's go. Oh, good gosh. But yeah, I can recommend people to give a... If Emperor had ticks to speech or watch. Damn it. it. It's quite fun. Oh, I forgot about that guy there. And now it's pins too. Move. Let's go. Actually, you... And you go in there. And if they group up at any point here, we can... Uh, <laughs> we can introduce them to uh, some American hand grenades. I was Let's trained see. for this. Okay, thanks for being all the same. No problem. Being that yeah. as active or inactive. Let's... Yeah. Hey, thank you for joining. And be careful lurking, for right. we have not cleaned uh, the lower tech in a while. Okay. Yeah, that, that was my mistake for, well, forgetting about this guy over here. Where... Where'd he go? Quick, wasn't okay. it? Okay. Not that quick, Inferno. Huh? Okay, Tiny, pick up someone right. again. Okay. Now, moving on, this time somewhat seriously. <laughs> no. There. Okay, can we get him there? Yes, we can. Okay. Now, uh, we shouldn't have any issues to getting up here and getting the sword and the knife back and there were those bubbles again. I'm guessing it's... Oh, I mean, it, it could be a sign of a shark or something being there. Let's actually take a that quick look. Shark. Mm -hmm. Might be something else for... I don't think shark leaves bubbles. Oh, oh! It's enemy divers. That makes more sense. Yeah. Ooh. Quickly get out of line of sight. These don't have a lesser area. Just get up. Okay, we can't just move underneath here. Go grab the other knife. Right, now we know what those bubbles are. And I actually forgot that enemy divers are a thing in this game. Yeah. It would make sense for otherwise. Uh, well, I guess Harpoogan would be used against the shark and crocs, but still. Uh, no, oh, spoiler, find a blowtorch in the hidden in the ship, in the sunken ship, in order to open the bunker door. Blow up the wall behind the golden monkey. Uh, steal the golden monkey, <laughs> what? Steal the key to the tunnels, and yeah, rescue the allied pilot, that was, <clears throat> that was who Wilson was talking about. Wilson is a castaway we've, uh, well, we didn't conscript him, he volunteered, and yeah, beyond that, just destroy the guns. Now, where is the key? Okay, oh, we're actually somewhat close to that, it's in one of these here. It's a bit too zoomed out to see accurately which of these two that is, but oh well. And yeah, it's actually of the real-time world, since Finn is here. Visible I think in I know, there. I think I know which building. 
probably the bigger of the two. This is probably an entrance to the tunnels, the smaller one. <clears throat> you know what? I just realized right. we, we can use that big cannon to blow up the other cannons, correct? Yeah, possibly. It's not an objective to destroy them. Hmm. Was it our big to destroy the cannons? Yeah, the, the, the big cannons, the artillery, not the AA and such. And with the big ones, it means the ones that are over in the, well, underground here. And those are big. Let's see. Climbing up here is going to be risky, since there are three that frequent this area. We could have Wilson distract them and just knife them in the back whilst he's serenading you know them what? with his horrible music. Mm. Oh dear. Get out of range there. He has good eyesight. Okay, we turn the cameras on them then. Yeah. yeah that is again going to just alert the entire island. Hmm. Actually... You probably can see that. Yes, he can. But he won't see this. I'm going. There we go. If we do use the gun now, oh, it isn't going to immediately. Oh, it isn't going to immediately alert them mm -hmm. because that guy had line of sight. Yeah. Uh, I'm going. Okay, he has. He can see the smokes, and he can actually see the body as well, but apparently he doesn't care about that. Will he care about this one, then? I'm going! Yeah. Hi height difference can be a bit uh, iffy. Yeah. But oh well. Hmm. That does mean that for until we deal with him, we are short one knife, but we have two more. What are you? You're diff dressed differently. The soldier. You're probably a pilot, I'm guessing. Just about how tight that seems to be on there. Okay. I don't think I've ever tried this mission by going through the middle of the island like this. So let's try and remain cautious. Okay. Dump your body. Can we not? Oh, okay, we cannot move around it here. Uh, which means we'll have to deal with this guy quickly before he spots the body and comes running. Or we can use it as lure. Or, yeah. As a lure. Maybe hmm. he's the lure is a better idea. I'm going. You might be a bit too close to the other one there. I'm going. But then again, we also have this one over there. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. He hasn't spotted the body yet, so he might not actually see it at all. Yeah. So let's start with luring. Oh. Someone found something. And he is just in not interested. Okay. I'm going. He had the blue line of sight there for a moment. I'm not sure what that means when they're looking at a well a lure. Hmm. Good question. In a moment. I don't think you're close. Ah. Yes, there we go. We found our wide open opening. I'm going! There we go. Okay, since we know that area is free, or free to hide the body in, we can just dump the other two here. Wait, you have three knives now? Uh, Inferno had one, uh, Finn's comes with one standard, and Tiny had one. So, you know, that's three total. Oh, oh fancy suits. What are you? 
an officer of a different color. Wait, they put a AA cannon on that? Apparently. I feel like that, uh, most of that uh, balcony should have collapsed. There we go, another one gone. Okay. Give me that. And this area is mostly secure. Like they're, they're only probably going to find these bodies if we set up the alarm again. And wait. Where's the guy who was... Oh, there he is. I, I completely overlooked him next to all the, the other browns. So I guess his uh, camouflage is working. Good camouflage. Okay, then. Next batch. Oh, how did you spot him, him so far away whilst he is crouch, not crouched prone? What the? <laughs> oh, come on. I just noticed a little arrow there. And that would be? They parked the plane so close that if they started, they're going to tear open the bridge. <laughs> and I'm a dock. I'm going. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Those two are too busy with yeah. the plane to see anything. Okay, let's lay an ambush here. I'm going. Ready that for him when he comes back again. Or, or get him. That was unintentional. I'm going. Oopies a candy, oopies a candy, oopies a candy. Yeah. What the heck? Well, Oh, now you can't get past there? Oh, what? Okay. And Vince is down again. Okay, yeah, I, I forgot I left Inferno outside. Alright. Uh, so here we go again. Okay, let them, they're going to... He had wire cutters? Okay. Alright then. Actually... Oh. Quick, quick, quick. Ooh. I got rid of a bunch more. Uh, that also brought them in here. Ooh. He is just barely away from getting downed. And I, yeah, they look around. They look rather zombie-like when they get fully downed, huh? Or just hurt so much. <laughs> Because they look, they look like they've been in a boxing match. I'm lost. Okay. These are the last two that we have at the moment. So no more shenaniganery. Hopefully that cleared out some of them that were... No, they did not kill any of the ones that were patrolling here. Okay, but at least that should have taken care of them as a later problem. And there they go again. They found something else. <laughs> they found... They found Finn! Well, they, they've been seeing him for quite a bit now. Hmm. Is with all of them running around like this, we could probably just... Okay, the man trap w was, went off, so someone died from that. And we can actually re 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 reuse that thing as well. Probably a good idea to do that. Yeah, and use some of those landmines that <laughs> that Inferno got. Okay, all quiet on the eastern front. They're probably going to. Are they going to alert over this? Yes, they are. It's just a hornet's nest that keeps setting itself off again and again. Oh, that would be such a juicy target now. 
but they would Actually, probably get Inferno killed. Once they <laughs> come down, let's put mines there. Yeah. So if they do, if they do set it themselves off again, uh, it'll probably get at least one of them. I'm ready. And this is just a target of opportunity. And you're the first one who's being shown some kind of some sort of mercy, mostly because he doesn't have his knife yet. So instead, just <laughs> oh there, oh. one extra. Wait, what, what did he say? There, he, I think he just said right away, sir. Just his normal lines. He does. They don't have special ones, I believe. I thought he said that you did to me. <laughs> Would have been a bit of an epic line, but sadly, I don't think he has that as a voice line. Yeah, and don't forget the man trap. It's me, sir. That's Shred's work. I don't think anyone else can use them. You. Okay. Just it's set that mine. there again, because we know there's more of them in here. It's done. Yep. Okay, you go hide. Okay. There we go. Okay, Tiny, see if you can collect him. Okay, I did. I did not know that you can actually hide in the br in the brush, like this. Agree. Probably should have tried to do that sometimes then. Okay. Okay, that is going to complicate matters a bit. Okay. Quickly. Okay, okay, we were lucky there. He was just in a blind spot. Oop. And that was someone coming to take a look and getting bit. Let's go. Okay, move oh to the dear. back. Right out. Okay. Doki. Threads. Does he have a... Oh yeah, we'll take that before they clean up the corpse. Shoot. Speaking of cleaning up the corpse, let's dump it in here before they go off on that again. We found a friend for our other Hi, friend. Sure. Dead Bill. <laughs> the Muppets window. reference. Yeah, but it's, I still remember that one the most brutal house he is. Dead Bill, the Bill, Dead Bill, and Half Dead Bill. You. Okay. Tiny, guard the door. Uh -huh. Inferno. Uh, let's go plant some flowers. Oh no. Now I remember another scene for that the mob at Treasure Island. They killed that Bill! That's it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can't set off our own mines. Yes. I think the man I think the little pop-up handbook even mentioned that because they will quote unquote know where the mine is so we should be somewhat safe from that hmm Wilson is still there with those two in their infinite uh, <clears throat> infinite workouts let's see okay we can't actually get into the bunkers without the key let's see then I'm pretty sure if we're hiding in stuff like this that we can't be found even if they are looking or maybe if they are maybe if they spot us going in but since we're out of med kits I'm not going to test that we'll be out yes, sir. Oh. Oh. I mean, there's probably more to be found throughout okay. the level but since we need to bring all of our people Wrong back off on the We'll have to escape with everyone. It'll probably be better if we just be careful now. Yeah, I mean, we did some experiments and we learned some good. But yeah, they've also done some mistakes. Yeah. Hmm. If you like. Oh, I am tempted to aim the can at the guy on the bridge. Yeah. yeah. Damn it. Are they coming from this 
gunfire. It looks like this guy is just on a... Oh, wait, they're probably... I'm going. They're probably heading for the tunnel entrance there. So one of them is going to set off yeah. the man trap outside. Let's see. Well, sir. Yep. <laughs> one of them set it off. Actually, this is a good yes. little moment for some disruption. Let's go. There we go. I'm going. <laughs> Not sure what he would have preferred. The knife or the music. Mm -hmm. Okay. It seems he was dumb enough to actually run past his ally. Okay. I'm going. Okie dokie. You go grab him. Just dump him inside at the door. And this, since we've been having such success here, put it down again. Uh -huh. Okay. Also, I find it's funny how both Thread and Tiny used you know, aim their gun with one hand. Uh -huh. And then we have Inferno dual wielding that thing. Yeah. yeah, even Finn's one hands it. <laughs> okay. Now, is this guy just. Okay, he's not on red at the moment. Not sure why he immediately went aggro then, but oh well. Uh, let's see, we have those yeah. two. Let's just. Let's get these to thin out the herds in case we set things off again. Nope. Oh, like that. Because I accidentally switched to Tiny instead of uh, grabbing the grabbing the knives. Okay, just hide in the water. Oh, hello there. Easy targets. Or not so easy now. Uh, yeah, underwater we can only use the spear gun. There is no melee on the water. <laughs> okay, there we go. Do Okay, we can't even investigate them. Okay. Goes through here, and there we have that sunken ship. And very nice music. Yeah. Let's see. I'm pretty sure the divers can set off the alarm. Since, well, they're underwater and everything. So maybe if we yeah. are quick. A bit of us probably before uh, you have that tech, you could speak on the water in some way. Yeah. Okay. At, at least not for divers. You, you could probably do that uh, in a submarine. Yeah. Close. There we go. It is a bit. It is a bit annoying since you can't get a good 3D view of where you are at times. Yeah, we can enter through there. Yeah. It's nothing in here. So can we get into the other end? Yes, we can. And there's the blowtorch. Portable... Or, uh, or, yeah. <clears throat> Portable... Acetylene blowtorch. Uh, very useful for field engineering tasks. Uh, where you want to use it. It will penetrate some closed metal doors. The blowtorch is not a weapon, but can be used as such in case of emergency. Well, it is... Take a very damn hot mini flamethrower. Yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Let's uh, take a look can... around more. Yeah, and uh, you probably like you, you have seen a blue torch, right? Yep. You could also once it's out of gas, whatever it is, give someone a good whack with it. Yeah, like an improvised crowbar. 
Uh, more like an improvised club. Okay. Let's see if we can get the drop on this guy. Oh dear. Wait, jump? Well, this... Getting to swim on someone doesn't sound as a... <laughs> okay. Oh, we've got a shark, but that's about all on, that's left on this side. And I'm hoping that sharks die in one shot as well. Oh, yeah. Uh... There we... Yeah, they do. Okay. I'm mostly just exploring around for any goodies that we might find. Like, well, med kits. Oh, that was seaweed. How, wait, how the heck did I mistake seaweed for cacti? <laughs> okay, well, you guess, I guess you could call them the cacti of the sea. Okay, shark. And we are very clearly... Actually, can we get inside? We are very clearly underneath the boat. Is there a way to sneak into this thing from here? There actually is! Okay. Wait, that might be the, the booty drop the divers from, perhaps. <laughs> Let's do a quick save, and then we'll take a look inside. There's a good chance Finns will just pop in and have his head blown off by a shotgun or something. Not that that's in this game. Oop. Okay. In a moment. A bit compact. So a bit difficult for us to get a good look. But this guy looks vulnerable to me. Damn it. No, not stupid. Get out. There we go. Just hit and run. Or hit and swim. Oh, dear. Okay, well, we, we annoyed them at the very least. So let's check in the next area of the island. And yeah, we really need some freaking med kits or some canned food. Does anyone have canned food on them? It's done. Now, I, I guess, uh, in the meantime, he could he could just nibble on the fish food. Wilson! Okay. Careful. Yeah, like all the other soldiers, they don't have that well of a peripheral vision, huh? Or good sight in their peripheral vision or whatever it was again. It would make sense for... I don't know if those... The diving gear gave you a good... Uh, view, that kind of viewed view. With the yeah. uh, it, it special goggles. It, it tends to block your the line of sight on the sides. Basically forcing you to have a sort of tunnel vision. Yeah. Still not. I, I remember there being something, as you can find in the waters around here. Uh, come on, follow after that thing. And wait, I think we've done a full circle now. Hmm. Okay, then either I'm misremembering, or actually. No, we've not we've not done a full circle yet because we haven't found the corpse of the diver that we killed at the start of the circle. I remember you being able to find something nice on the water in this mission. But I might just be well having difficulty finding it because I don't remember the button to highlight you know, things you can actually interact with. Okay, how did that I quote unquote see him as he was out of his vision. I, I guess he could have smelled the, the blood or we just got too close, but oh well. Here. Okay. Yeah, this is where we started. So let's end the tour here. 
Okay. No one has set off the trap yet. In a moment. Now I think we're going to have to work our way uh, not towards here because I I do not want to risk uh, Finns with this low health trying to dodge three di different people here. But we could technically lure them to well get at least one of them on the mine. But let's instead head this way. I'm going. And yeah. maybe also just a good idea to get Tiny to do some work and give Finns a break. Boy. Wait, you're, mi you're missing a knife. Oh, wait, that's over here. Near the plane. Yep. Huh? Okay. And since the ground is actually soft here, we can... Well, mostly soft. We can actually use uh -huh. the uh, berry ability that uh, Tiny has. Okay. First off, though, a save. Since I do not want to lose the amount of progress that we have made here. Hmm. <clears throat> Pardon? This is mine. Okay. Now, we wouldn't be able to lure him since he has smokes already. Well, he's coming to check, but he's just a worker, so he's not actually going to alert, sound the alert. Okay, okay we can climb, we can go in there. But yeah, these workers are just dumb. There we go. Now, what's in here? Oh, one guy. And now one guy again. No, not... Okay, just pistol. We're gonna hide the bodies in there. You gonna do was, what? Um, yeah, we can hide the bodies in here. Are you sure they're all gonna fit in there? Uh, we can see. <laughs> Turn this place into a corpse clown in car. Oh, no, that would be a thing. Okay, of those two... You of course you remind me I forgot to check out the... Uh, Killer Clouds of, from Outer Space, the game. Oh, yeah, <laughs> okay, the moment we step in here, they, those are going to note this. Or identify us as a hostile. So, like Wilson, uh, time for another concert. There he comes charging through. I'm ready, sir. Okay, there we go. Uh -huh. Oh, dear. oh. Uh, come the fuck on. Oh, I went the wrong way. Okay. Oh, and the tough. Of course, I forgot about Fins. Have you out of healing packs, Andre? Yep. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going to need to find new ones, and that actually means a tiny can still fight. And yes, this is him hidden like this. That's it. Hops back out again. Okay. Yeah, we. Hmm. We, we may want to reload, perhaps, for this one. Uh, actually, yes. I, I, I got too careless there. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, uh, by the way, since I mentioned Killer Clubs out of space, uh, you have heard of another 80s classic? Perhaps, uh, Killer Tomatoes? Ki actually, yeah, that was the one I was to say. <laughs> But want to know something Wait, fun about that? Mm, what then? Yeah. They have a cartoon series. Yep. <laughs> Good. Okay, let's break a bit more firepower. In case things start to go wrong again. Uh, you go deliver that 
Actually, yeah. let's go into the tunnels and oh, try and deal with that. Oh no, I have a flashback for Kill, uh, Kill Tomatoes 2, which I've not seen the entirety of, I'm but going. I saw a little bit of the beginning. Yeah. Uh, apparently, Tomatoes made illegal in that universe. So as well, you can, you can guess why. Yeah. And so we're entering pizzeria, and you all know what they replaced the tomato sauce the pizza with? Uh, pineapple? No. Pear? Strawberry yam. <laughs> okay. Well, at least it's red, it but me. still, that made me gag for the first time I heard that. <laughs> Actually, fuck it. There we go. Okay. I got just a bit too close to the officer there, I think. Oh well. Agreed. Okay, I get that this is a mostly defensive position. Uh -huh. So they would they wouldn't need things that are too offensive like a rifle. But still <laughs> How few of, how, of you have actual freaking rifles? Okay. Oh, med kits! Uh -huh. Wait. The Inferno can actually operate the AA guns? Right, yeah. Not that that actually would do anything, I think, but still. Well, technically, it's still a gun. It would be uh -huh. a big gun. Okay. And can you... Actually... Actually... You should maybe technically to be able to just lure them and shoot a person with them. Yeah, that is what Rommel uh, did, but I think those were more uh, flak cannons than uh, the, this type of A-gun. A Wait, who? Uh, Rommel, one of the uh, German, uh, <clears throat> one of the German generals. Where he fought in Africa, and there he, I, I don't know if he was the first to do it, but. From what I've heard, he just uh, <clears throat> he uh, decided to use flak cannons meant for anti-aircraft uh, as anti-tank weapons instead. Supposedly, from what I've heard. Oh dear! The yeah, first time I saw something like that happen was from good old Tremors. Okay. Let's I think you can guess who one. was manning it. Birds. Good old bird. He had loaded an anti-air cannon on a truck to shoot shriekers at. Leave it to me. Oh. Oh, I'm so happy to see oh, you guys. Dear. I was shot down two days ago by this damn anti-aircraft gun. If you'll help me, I'd like to return the favor by taking you and your men off the island with the seaplane. Oh, short and simple. They have tunneled under the island and have constructed a huge network of passages. There is the bunker with the anti-aircraft guns to the west and a communication room over the east hill. The official in charge is in there. He is the only one with the key to access the tunnels that will take us to the guns. There's hey, a little folks it'd be in a there. pity to leave the island without a souvenir. There's a chamber near the communications room where they keep a statue of a monkey made of solid gold. Once inside the chamber, I'm sure we could blow through the wall with explosives and take the statue with us, although it must be very heavy. The statue is like a symbol to the soldiers here. They believe they can't lose while they have it. Um, At your I service. think even Tiny we struggle to lift that one up. Yeah, especially if it is actually solid gold, since that stuff is actually pretty damn heavy. Agreed. Yeah. Wait, have you realized? Yes. Can't you technically make golden bullets if you're desperate enough? Mmm. Gold is a rather soft metal, so it. Awaiting order, sir. It would still hurt you if you're not wearing any defense against it, oh. but against any uh, yeah, any sort of metal layer or other Kevlar or something, it would probably just uh, yeah work less good, <laughs> even less uh, well than normal bullets. This is mine. Yeah, but it still it would still probably pack a punch. Uh -huh. Yeah. The due to the weights, as I remember. Lead okay. is a soft metal, but also damn heavy. True, but... Hmm. I'd, I'd need to look up uh, the ah, material boy. aspects and... Uh, 
But it could be that gold could be deformed just by firing. So can we dump them in the plants here somewhere? No. So it could be so basically, you're likely to miss with a golden bullet. Yeah. All right, that will explain why people prefer lead since what well, lead is soft. It's still e e more less soft. Not not as soft as gold, basically. Yeah. Agree. Let's see. This is oh, a well, very busy area. I, don't, I, I forgot if lead is soft as gold, but it has a different... definitely have a different uh, temperature melting point. Yeah, that, that could possibly also be a thing, that a gold bullet would just melt in the as it passes through the barrel and just block it. Oh, that'd be awkward. It looks like this side of the bridge is undefended. So we can probably just try and sneak through here. Wait, wait. I think I know how to use a golden bullet. And I'm, I'm only correct with this on, on a te technicality. Good. You load it in a sling. Okay, what did they find? A lottery ticket? I'm ready. Well, what they found was the game crashing. Okay. Uh oh. Okay. Well, let's, let's hope see. that didn't do what. Uh, let's hope that didn't do what it did last time. Uh. You can't see the game, I'm guessing. It did it again. Now I only see you looking at that without me. The the voice meters down there are still working. Oh, now you pull up again. And this. Hmm. We're gonna need to restore the PC again. Yeah, that was what was required last time. Though, let's take a look at the timer. If it's close enough, we might just call it there. Mm, half an hour still. Um, yeah, we might need to call it early then. We'll have to redo a decent bit of that. Uh, <coughs> but yeah, I, I don't know if just re hmm. restarting the computer and everything last time. I had to restart twice for it to finally work. Um. So yeah, maybe we just need to call it a bit early then and... Yeah, I, I have no idea. For one, I have no idea what set them off there. I don't think there were... Hmm, I don't think there were any corpses left for them to stumble across. They didn't find the pilot because he was safe. So, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, and also probably good... Since we're calling it early, we, at least we know what happens. We know we can... In some way... Get extra prepared for next time we stream it. Yeah, we, we can we can go half an hour extra uh, on one of the streams tomorrow, maybe. Uh, for, let's see. <clears throat> for now, though, before we call it off, we're going to raid someone, of course. So, I get the axe. Change window. The browser. <clears throat> Pardon again if that was audible. Uh, let's see. From down to low, we have Cyber D uh, Cyber Delish, who is streaming Digimon World. And then we have someone else streaming Digimon. Uh, the Digital Hazard is streaming Digimon Story Lost Evolution. Then we have Halloween 4545 streaming Final Fantasy XIV. Viking Blonde is online, but it's currently at the just chatting bit. Let's Rain World Downpour. I have no idea what is that what that's supposed to mean. Uh, Kikoskia is streaming Enter the Gungeon. And then we have Big V Streams streaming The Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind. Been a long ass time since I played that. Uh, Rococo Pouffet is streaming Sonic Frontiers. And then we get to the big names. So let's see. 
Any of those sound interesting, or shall we look at the recommended? Uh, let's see. I... Wait. Was that Iggy May displaying? Uh, let's see. Apollo Justice Ace Attorney. Uh, wait, sponsored as well? Oh, what's it? That's it. Oh, hashtag sponsored. Probably not by Konami or anything, but they probably have some sort of sponsor or something. Or I, uh, I don't know. No, no, I'm unsure if it's a good idea to raid someone that is spons currently sponsored. That feels rather rude. Then. Yeah. Um, I'd suggest we raid uh, side. No, uh, that's not Cyber Delish. Cider Delish. So shall we, shall we go raid Cider then? Yeah, let's. Okay, let me make sure that the site is muted so we don't accidentally steal their audio. Copy the name over because I'm too lazy to just type it out. Head to our place and slash raid paste. Uh, but before you do that, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Uh, thank you, Sensei, for showing up and chatting along a bit. And thanks for the look, of course. And uh, yeah, a late thanks to... Uh, G K Y S L C G L. If you that is, I don't think bots can follow. I'm not entirely sure on that, but I don't think I'm mostly positive that they can't. So uh, yeah, thank you for the follow, and uh, thank you as always, of course, Rick here. You're welcome as always, my friend. And yeah, I have the next two days off, but after that, I'll be going into night shifts. So. Yeah, the, on the, uh, let's see, it's Monday, so Tuesday, Thursday, and no, the f Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we can do some streams. Uh, but we'll have to see, yeah, we'll have more than plenty of time to, to fill our usual slots of two of the main game and one of the side game. And we'll see if, if we fill any of the other possible time slots with anything else. Probably at least one for some Valheim or Minecraft. Yeah, I built for more <laughs> Valheim. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we need to go exploring that since we finally got the wall to bloody work. <clears throat> oh, yeah, it's a fine wall. For now, though, let's start the raids. And uh, yeah, thank you all again. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then, be safe, everyone. And watch out for sharks. And I completely forgot to move over to here. <laughs> well, see you all next time. Be safe.